Nair here at Eco Build 2017. I'm here with David Smoker, the Business Development Director at ACO, um, who is here to talk to us about SUNS. Hi David, thanks for joining us. Um, could you please tell us um, about the concept of achievable SUDS? Yes, indeed. Um, well, I think sustainable drainage systems, SUDS, are, are well recognised as a very uh, valuable tool in the control of surface water, in um, particular in terms of mitigating risk. And sustainable drainage, used to be called sustainable urban drainage, has been around for a long time. And the uh, Syria SUDS manual, as sometimes called the SUDS Bible, has been around since early 2000s. Um, within the concept of SUDS is not only the control of uh, water quantity, flow rate and volume, but also improving water quality and improving amenity and biodiversity. So it's very often quoted as being the four pillars of SUDS. And there has been this um, belief or, or uh, approach that it's not SUDS if it doesn't have those, all those four. So in other words, if you're putting in sustainable drainage, you should always go and put in qu quantity control, quality, yeah. amenity, biodiversity. And it's, it's quite valid in terms of um, if, you, if you can get it right and if you can manage to get all four in, that is a significant benefit in terms of sustainable drainage because you're actually improving the environment and so on and so forth. However, um, through a recent uh, ICE, Institute of Civil Engineers uh, survey, um, we found that uh, one of the barriers to the implementation of SUDS was that there were site constraints or there were uh, constraints in terms of being able to get in some amenity or biodiversity. And we can understand that in particularly in urban environments where but they're fairly well built up and, and the potential to put in, in green areas is, is somewhat limited. Yeah. So the, the, what's been happening is that to a certain extent the view was, well if it's not green, if it doesn't have amenity and biodiversity, it's not suds, therefore we don't put suds in. The concept that we've, we're now pushing, that we're sorry, now uh, developing, is that having something in there, sustainable drainage in terms of quantity control or quality to control, is better than having nothing at all. So then do we get to the, uh, the concept of what's achievable? So in other words, there's best practice, but there's also good practice and achievable suds are a good practice. If I take an example, um, you have, uh, let's say, a main road, it's nowhere near any residential development, uh, and the main concern is controlling the volume going into a, a local brook, the amenity and biodiversity are not required. So concentrate on what, what is, is necessary and achievable. And so, in a nutshell, hopefully, uh, that, that's what achievable suds means. Thank you very much for talking okay. to us today.